my diamond art peeps this is diamond painting with Jack and I am Jack if you are new to my channel welcome 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 and if you are returning as always thank you for your continuing support I hope everybody is doing well on this Sunday the 22nd July 22nd it is 1 12 here in Norman Oklahoma and it is muggy and cloudy it rained on and off all day yesterday well yesterday morning and then today I don't know if we're gonna get any rain but it's really cloudy and like I said muggy so I just got home and I thought I need to do videos I need to really really bad so you guys I have so much unbagging un 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 it is crazy so what I'm going to do, because you know my videos tend to be long anyway, is that I'm going to just do probably several parts. So I think that I've got enough probably for four parts. So I'm going to do one a week, maybe two, until I get them done. But before I start that, I am going to do my useless information. And this one this video let me say this real quick is just for um a d stash okay so our first useless information is in paraguay dueling is still legal as long as both parties are blood donors well that's precious the five interlocking olympic rings are black blue red green and yellow because at least one of those colors are appears on every flag. Well that's cool. I really didn't know that one. Tipping is actively discouraged in New Zealand, Singapore, Thailand, and Japan. Okay, so if you are a waiter or a waitress, you cannot tip. Okay. And the last one, uh, lightning strikes the earth over 100,000 times a day. Of these, 10 to 20% causes a fire. All right. Interesting, interesting. Okay, guys. So, um, like I said, this is a D stash, and I have two. Uh, one is from Shanta from Diamond Shines with Shanta. And then the other one, I didn't ask if I could get permission to say her name. So I'll just show what I got. I met her through Mushy from Dark and Creepy Diamond Painting. So we'll just get right into it. And I couldn't wait, so I went ahead and opened up Shanta's. I got two. Actually, I got one canvas and then she threw in an, an extra canvas for me and I will show you that. But she added some little surprises. So this is like a keychain. It's a Hello Kitty keychain. How cute. And I've already said thank you to Miss Shanta, but thank you again. And if you have not checked out her channel, please do. So cute, so cute. And then I have a another Hello Kitty that I will sit up here. And then, look at this Hello Kitty bag. I wonder where she got this. It has a Starbucks clip, like that I would use for my badge. That's cute. And it's retractable. It's so cute. Oh, this is coffee scrubs. <gasps> it says coffee scrubs and rubber gloves. How cute. I didn't pay attention. I just thought it was a, a, a little a clippy. How cute. I don't know where she got that from. So that's that. And then I got some little sticky pads, some Hello Kitty sticky pads, which I can never have enough of. And here's another little pad. 
And I think this one I can actually. Oh, how cute is that? So here is, you probably want to see it this way. Hello Kitty. And then you open it up and then here's the pads. How cool. I would definitely can use these for work when I'm writing down notes and things like that. And then she sent me a pen. This is really cute. Oh, look, it's, it's Princess Tiana. How cute is that? Oh, this is an actual pen, pen, not a diamond painting pen. How cute. So are you twist? And there's a pink. Oh, how neat. Thank you, Shanta, so much. So please go check out her channel. She does a lot of unboxings. Um, she does um, like small hauls and uh, accessories and pins and putties. And... Um, obviously canvases and then some completions and everything. So she had a D stash and so I wanted to really to help her out and so I got this. This is uh, Distracted by Diamonds and I have never, I don't think I've ever had one of, of their canvases. So I thought I really liked the red trucks and so this is a 62 by 75. So let's open this up. And if you have watched her channels, you know all of her canvases are like the size of Montana. And you want to wait until you see the other one that that I got from her. It is huge. I was like, Shanta. Oh, this is neat. This is definitely going to be done next year. But I, like I said, I love these red trucks. When I was growing up, um, Oops, sorry, I just hit the camera. My dad had a green truck like this. Let me see if I, I'm trying to get it. I'm going to roll it back. Oh, thank God. I thought that it was a square because the box showed a square. I guess a round. Thank you. Thank you, baby Jesus. All right, so I'm gonna move you. Sorry, no, no sickness. I'm sorry. So here it is. I love it. So this is distracted by diamonds, and if I'm not mistaken, they're no longer in business, and I can't remember. Who bought them out? I want to say the Diamond Painting Fanatics bought them out, but I am not 100%. So if you guys know, put that in the comments. So here is the thumbnail. And here's the, the drill fill. It looks really clear. It's got that chip lap background where they are, looks like they just pulled into their parked outside of their barn or garage or whatever it is so it is oh that's not bad 38 colors it is not Tita approved because one is a symbol so it's symbols alphabet and numbers. Now number 
actually, number one looks like a little raindrop or a teardrop. I have not ever seen that symbol. And then also number four. I am not 100% on that one either. I've never seen that. I'm kind of hope I'm not making you dizzy. It looks like a sideways B. That's what it kind of looks like. Now, down here in the bottom, look at all that confetti. Look at all that confetti. But I like that it's just 35 colors. Now the background up in here, if you see, all of that is what you call color blocking because those are all one symbol. And then down here, you'll see a lot of different symbols. So that would be considered confetti because I'm gonna be changing out my colors. A quite a bit. So this again is a 65 by 75 and it does it she put the toolkit in so it's just a, a blue pen looks like two pads of uh, wax and then the and a let's see what this oh it's a four placer and I like that I'm going to keep that out because I, I use the four placer a lot okay and it's already kitted up thank god look at all of the white there's three bags of white and I don't think that there's any ABs on this. On the bag, it has the um, canvas number. So it's DBDR1065. And you've got DBDR1065. So if you like to uh, separate your drills from your canvas, you won't have any problems finding. And this white, which is a check mark, is 5200. That's what I thought. So there's three bags of 5200. And these are pretty good sized bags. And on the bags, it has the DMC codes. So on the legends, it also has the numbers and the and the DMC code. Oh wow! And it comes with a paper legend, and it has on the canvas that is waterproof, anti-fade, non-ironing, and it's also green friendly. So the name of this canvas is called Sweet Pea, and it's by Wendy Marcus. And here is the paper legend, and here is the thumbnail again. And I'm trying to read what's on the... It's a sweet pea on the license plate. It says S-W-T-P-E-A. S-W-T-P-E-A. Oh, how cool is that? And their motto was smile, sparkle, sparkle repeat. So, as I said, this company is no longer in business. So I'm not sure if the new company has this or not. But how cute. This is, I think actually, no, I think I have done one. I think I've done one. I'm not 100% sure. But here it is again. 
and we step out. This is going to be really great to work on. I love it. I love it. I love it. Love it. Okay. So let me put everything back because this will definitely be a next year project. So let me put everything back. Where's the box? Okay. So uh, this was the canvas that she gifted me. Look at this. I told Shanta, where did you get this big blanket from? Now that's what she has is blankets. They're not canvases, they're blankets. Now this is a square. And this is, um, oh, this is from Touch the Soul Art. And it is, um, has 47 colors and two ABs. And it is, one is one down to nine. And then 10 to 47 are alphabets and symbols. Look at this blanket, you guys. And this is a Reagan Kubitschek, which I have never worked on one of her canvases. So we have a legend on the bottom left, top right. Oh my God, you guys, this is huge, huge. Huge, huge. This is a 65 by 85. Okay, so here is the, the thumbnail. And these are individual they peel off, so that's really nice, I think. Yeah, they peel off. And then you have some extra ones that you can use for other canvases. Like I said, two ABs. 666 is an AB and 740. Oh, okay, so this is a little sassy one. So it's, she is sitting on, looks like a log. Oh, she's sitting, like, yeah, on, as a tree. And she's got her back to you. So this is her booty. And then she's got these, is it just one? So one snake. I was like looking at this and I was like, I can't, what is that? But it's her, she's sitting to, like I said, with her showing her head turned over her shoulder. This is so cool. And like I said, this is my very first Reagan Kubitschek. And it's a square and it is really a lot. Look at all these muted colors. Now there is, I'm just not seeing it. So you have a sticker label and then you have a paper legend. Forty-five colors, and it has listed the numbers and symbols, the DMC code, the quantity in each bag, and then here is the actual quantity, and then the weight of the bags, and then the number of bags that you should have 
with each color. So this is uh, like 310, there are four bags of 310. But if you see, look at her hair. I'm sure all of that is gonna go there. And on the ABs, there's just one bag. And let me see if I can pull them out. I'm not gonna try to show them on where they are on the canvas. But I am, let me see if I can find them out. Too long. So it's 45, no, 46 and 47. Let me see. Oh, here we go. So here's 46, and this is the 666. Look at that pretty red. And then 47 is this really pretty orange, almost a uh, Halloween color. So pretty. It's got some stragglers in there. I bet they go, no, they're not ABs. They're just stragglers that went along for the ride. So there is this one. Square plus two ABs. Okay, so it should be 55 bags total. And I will, when I get to this, I will go through it. Again, this will be a next year project. So, Shanta, thank you very much for. The gift, I wasn't expecting this. Okay, so let me roll her back. Okay, so the here is out. My other two, I'm gonna kinda turn you. Don't look, I don't want you to get seasick. There you go. So Mushy from Dark and Creepy Diamond Painting is having an event and it um, is, she has, um, it's a heart series that she has collected and so she, I forget the name of it, so please go check out the channel and she can explain and I believe if I am not mistaken that it starts in September. So this young lady was um, selling these, and so I was like, okay, good, because I did I did a heart one that I did from Raven's Diamond Art, and so um, I was like, I don't really have anything that's a heart. I did have some Hello Kitties that had hearts in them, and that's what I was going to do. But she was selling these really, really inexpensive. And so even with shipping, it was still inexpensive. So I was like, okay, cool. All right, so here's the first one. And this is the one that I will do because the one that I did for Ray Raven's Diamond Art was red. So this is a blue heart. And it has, fl yeah, flowers on it, which you don't want, but. <laughs> when we do, for my job, if a lot of, probably a lot of you know, but if those who are new, I'm a nurse. And one of the things, my job says that we do TEEs, and that's where they take a scope. Have, go down the back of your, make you swallow it, and it looks at the back of your heart, and you're looking for any type of vegetation. So these pretty hearts is something that you wouldn't want to see. But we're not doing it to EE, so this will be okay. 
So I like this, light letters on dark background. So the background is C, which is 939, it's not 310, it's 939. And you have dark on light, and it looks pretty clear. I'm not seeing anything. You have one through eight in the in numerical order, and then nine through 18, it's only 18 colors, is the alphabet, but they're not in alphabetical order. So this should work up really pretty fast, because look at all of those C's. And what I am going to do is, I try when it's like really saturated like that, try to do the background first. And you guys, I have a ruler. One of the, the diamond painting rulers that I use on a canvas that I just finished. I had gotten it probably, probably three or four months ago. And I used it and I was like, no, I don't know if I really like it. But then I thought, I'm going to try it again because the, the canvas that I just finished, the whole background was, was like this, but only it was blue, like a sky blue. So I thought I would try it out again, and I really liked it. I, you know, I find myself, if I try something and it doesn't work out, I immediately just think, oh, I just can't do it. But I just need to just keep practicing. And so it worked out really great. So I'm just going to throw my ruler down. In fact, I need to order a couple of more, a couple of more of them. But this is really nice. It's pretty clear. Um, now, I'm not really good at pointing out the kind of like trouble places until I really start laying down uh, drills. But so far from what I can see, it is going... I don't see anything yet that is jumping out at me because... They are pretty, it's pretty clear. Oh my God, the C's are everywhere, even down here. All in here. And C, I'm just going to, I just want to look to see how many is back. And here are the colors. And they are already kitted up. I love it. I love it. I love it. I love it. I used to, when they came kitted up, I would still put them in a container. But now, I just work right out of the baggies. One, I'm too lazy. I should put them in a container, but one, I'm too lazy. So 10 is C. Boy, I hope there's going to be enough. I mean, this is, they're pretty good size, but I would think that there should probably be more. There should be at least one more bag, but I'm not seeing it, but this is it. So luckily for 9.39, I have, um, uh, Spares. So if I run out, I hope I don't. I hope I don't. And I like the fact that it is just 18 colors. That is wonderful. Because I told you guys that I'm going to try when I'm doing um, events to do like a 30 by 40 or do a, a partial so that way I'm not give, getting overwhelmed because next month I think I have like four canvases that are bigger we'll just fight with this later that are bigger than 30 by 40s so and I'm not getting 
like crazy, but but I don't want to um, stress myself out or get overwhelmed. Oh, this one is really neat. I love it. And I'm not sure where she where she got these. I'm guessing Amazon, but I don't know that for sure. This is really neat. I may, I may try to do them both, but if not, I'm definitely doing the blue one for Mushy's event. Oh, I love this. Look at this one. And the vowels are all gold color. And then the, the vessels run down through the heart. And they're all pure gold. The heart itself is red. And then it's got more of that vegetation that you don't want. You don't want to see this. But nice. These really pretty flowers. This is 18 colors as well. One is one down to eight, and then again, alphabetical from nine to 18, but not in alphabetical order. DMC codes are listed. So here's your legend on the left lower and the right upper. And here is a thumbnail. I didn't show the thumbnail on the other one. So there is the thumbnail. Again, it looks pretty clear. Now these, this one has the very light training wheels. You can see that. So you definitely probably want to pull out your light pad for this one. So I'm looking, I don't see anything, but again, I won't know until I start laying drills. Now this one did not come uh, bagged up. It's in the trains. So here are the colors. And I don't think either one of these had ABs. But both of them are round. I don't think I said that. So both of these are round. And it does have the code on it, the canvas code. So it's Y770, Y770, 30 by 40. Okay. All right, you guys. I love these both. I, I really like this one, but I want to do the blue one. So that's when I'm going to start. Okay, so before I go, I'm going to do a little homework. And I also want to remind you guys about my event that's coming up next month. starts August 1st through the 31st. And it is called, What Was I Thinking? Now, that can be left up to so many numbers of interpretation. You bought a canvas six months ago. Didn't get to it, didn't get to it, going through your stash and now you pull it out while you're looking for something, you pull that canvas out and you're like, what was I thinking when I bought that? It could be the fact that you got it on sale, it could be the fact that maybe someone sent it to you and you're just like, yeah, it's not totally my cup of tea, but it's enough that you would not, didn't want to get rid of it. Or the fact that you got this canvas that's the size of Montana because you got caught up with the, hey, I want to do large canvases because that's how I got caught up with hey, I want to do large canvases. And then it's like, you've got all these large canvases and it's like, oh my God, I don't want to do these. So 
anything like that, whatever your reason for picking your canvas, it's fine. Doesn't have to be a new start. You don't have to finish it. License, unlicensed, does not matter to me. My email address is listed in my description. So if you don't have Facebook or you don't have a YouTube channel, you can email me uh, and I will show your progress. We're going to show our progress every Thursday. Um, let's see what else. There's no prizes. Just getting to know your creators and other creators around you. On the 1st of August, I will do a um, video showing what I'm working on. I've already showed it, but I will do a video showing what I'm working on. Hopefully, I will have laid some drills down. And uh, I will list at that time, I will list the people that are in, that are involved. And if you please in this video or in, uh, let me know if you want to be included so that I can have you listed for August 1st. Okay? And then after me in September, it is going to be Wendy from Diamond and Stuff and she is doing seasons. So uh, get your canvases ready. And then October, it's going to be shenanigans with the Bergs, and she is doing sugar skulls or Holly Halloween theme. And I'm really looking excited to, for that. Okay, so I'm just going to go up to October, and then um, the other creators will will take it further from that. I will tell you that there is not a Paint Along with Friends in December. Uh, Yvonne and Laura are allowing people just to take it easy for that month, to spend time with family, or if you are wanting to get caught up with whips, or if there's another event that you want to join, that would be your time to really uh, do that and not worry about Paint Along with Friends, okay? All right, so I think that is it for my D stash. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, I, if you hit that thumbs up on the way out. Each of the creators that are doing an event are going to be getting one of these thumbs up. Thank you for being awesome. And then every month that creator will get the original thumbs up that we will sign and then send to the next one. So I will send Wendy that one as soon as I get mine, okay? All right, so I think that's it. I'm sure I am forgetting something I always do. So um, I wanna say thank you to new subscribers. I really appreciate you giving me a chance. And uh, I'm looking at my time, so let me get off of here. So remember to be kind to one another. Keep cool, keep diamond painting, and I will see you guys in my next video. Bye, guys.